everybody hey YouTube how's it going everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel and you don't know who I am I'm your girl Bella oh trust me I'm your girl Bella hi guys how's it going well I didn't vlog yesterday I'm tired y'all I'm tired I'm just tired my house is in disarray again again okay <laughs> so last night so what am i gonna i want to i want to tell you guys a whole bunch of stuff so I'll, i'm gonna start i'm gonna start that i'm gonna start yip yapping um so grab a cup of coffee because we're by the coffee bar anyways and i want to show you the coffee bar in depth i really want to do that i never made a video on how i decorated it but i really want to show you my coffee bar today so well i'll show you that in a minute Okay, so you all know that if you've been following me along, you all know that this year I am struggling. Like the struggle is real. I'm really struggling to get that Christmas feel, that, that something, that something special. So last night, I'm sitting on the couch. I don't know. Yeah, I think I was sitting on the couch. Or maybe it was this morning. I don't even remember. No, it was last night. Yeah, it was last night. So I'm sitting on the couch and I'm 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 going through the comments because I want to I want to read all the comments for the last video because we have the giveaway and I haven't finished re reading them all. I haven't I haven't finished reading them all, so you know that. But I got a message from a wonderful subby. Hi Nancy, and she said to me, she reminded me. She gave me that little edge, right, like that little poke, and she said, Bella. Christmas is not about the decorating. She was so right because that's what I was struggling with. I wasn't thinking, I wasn't putting it in my heart. Like, why are you decorating, Bella? Because when I decorate, I decorate from my heart, right? I decorate from my heart and I decorate for the, for the spirit of Christmas. And I wasn't doing that. I wasn't doing that. This is all for our Lord and Savior. This is how I show my love for him. Um, I am a person that shows my love through actions, okay? That, so you all know. Um, like if I cook for you, that means I really care about you. Um, if, you know, that's my, that's my love. That's my love language, let's say, okay? So when she said that, I said, oh my God, that's what I've been missing. That's it. So I sat in prayer this morning and I, and I thanked him and I, I thanked him for allowing me to have all this stuff, all this gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. I mean, my God, I just, and I, and I realized how blessed I am. And I realized that is the true meaning of Christmas. So thank you, Nancy. I needed that. I needed that. You know, I love you all so much. This is what you do. See, I do for you, but you do for me. So I just, I, I, I really want to thank you. I just really want to thank you all. I'm telling you, my channel would not be possible if it wasn't for you amazing, amazing, amazing humans. So if someone didn't tell you today that they love you, I love you more than you'll know. More than you will know. And thank you for coming into my life. Okay, the coffee bar. Coffee is a big part of my life. <laughs> I grew up drinking coffee. I love coffee. I cannot live without my coffee. My coffee bar. This is the smallest coffee bar I have ever, ever, ever had. Uh, yeah, we're we're in our we're in our regular attire, folks. Black leggings, and today we worked it up in a great t-shirt. Um, I'm gonna bring you in closer. I'm gonna take you off the tripod. This is the smallest coffee bar I've ever had. I've always had these big elaborate coffee bars and I, I you know, I, I go all out and I do all these things, with coffee and stuff, and I love it. And this is what I came up with. I mean, it is the best solution ever, but this is what I came up with. So I'm gonna take you off the tripod and show you that. And then I'm gonna show you the brand new chandelier. It's up in the kitchen. And then I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna to do today. And I have a little message. 
And then yours truly is going to clean. Well, I'll tell you that in a minute. I'll tell you that in a minute. Okay, let's turn the, let's take you off the tripod and show you the coffee okay, bar. Okay, so I want to show you this really in depth and, and give you guys lots of ideas to think outside the box. This is a little cabinet from Hobby Lobby. I love this cabinet. Love, love, love it. Great little idea. I could put some spoons in there. I got mugs down there. I got seasonal mugs down there now. And this is my little coffee station. Let me let me pan up so you could see the whole thing. But I'll go into depth with it. Okay, so what I what I did is I have my Nespresso machine and I got this little mug here, the Comfort and Joy mug. That's from Walmart last year. And then I used a, a, a tea towel because I, I like that kind of idea. And I put a little tree and a little, you know, the canister. I had two of those canisters. One broke already. And back there is one of my Mrs. Claus's mugs that I love to use. Love, love, love to use. So that's there. And then here, this sign stayed. Coffee is my true love. And then I had bought these two little shelves from Ross. They were very, very inexpensive. And why I like them is because the wood matched the wood on the little um little cabinet and i thought that would be perfect so all i've done here is i strung this very very simple garland you could see and um a very simple garland and then i have my black metal canister i think i'm gonna go to hobby lobby and see if they have one smaller um to replace the the the, the ceramic ones and then in this little, uh, sorry, it's not focusing. In this little um, bowl, it's just the little spoons, the little peppermint spoons, wood spoons from Hobby Lobby from last year. Some to-go cups. These are so cute. Look how cute these to-go cups are. It's a redhead and a blonde in the little toques and sweaters. It's adorable from Home Goods. Yeah, I think Home Goods or TJ Maxx. I got these, and they're nice if you want to take a nice hot beverage with you. But here in Southwest Florida, I'm still struggling with hot beverages. And then I put my um, old fashioned cocoa sign that's from Michaels. I finally found one of these little guys. And then this one is my new one from the at home store. And then these two little book boxes, just, you know, to add some color. And then up there, I put another little Christmas tree, another sign, and my Mr. and Mrs. Claus's mug. And how I have the Mr. and Mrs. Claus's mugs up there, I put glue dots. And then I got a flickering candle. And that um, little lantern was a gift from my friend Lucy. She gifted me an Amazon card, and I bought that. And so I always try to keep it up, remind me of all the beautiful gifts I got. And here's that uh, Mackenzie dupe wreath from last year. Guys, I am still loving this wreath. I I am not going to part with this wreath. I think it looks so good. This is my this is the my favorite wreath I ever did. I duped this last year. I um I duped it last year. Uh, I copied it off the Mackenzie Child catalog and it, and that little house in there lights up. So yeah, so I'm telling you, you you can you can create masterpieces with uh, with just little bit of things. Cause I think I think last year when I made this wreath, we um, did it together on a video and we priced it out. It was like two hundred and something dollars. Anyways, don't look in my kitchen. It's cute, right, guys? It's super super cute, super cute, super cute. <laughs> you know. This is such a good idea. I'm gonna tell you why this is such a good idea. This is such a good idea to do in your home if you, you know, because it's the small things like this that can bring you joy. I mean, you don't have to spend a lot of money. You really don't. You really don't have to spend a lot of money. Just make yourself something cute. I mean, even, let's say you don't have a wall like this and you're not gonna go out and buy a cabinet and all that, right? Even if you have like a little area on your countertop, get yourself a pretty tray, put your coffee maker, buy a really great cream and sugar, 
um, you know, something festive or, or one that you've been eyeing forever, like maybe an expensive one, like a McKenzie Child one, that's expensive. Um, you know, treat yourself because it's the little things in life that are gonna bring us joy, right? It's the little things in life because those little things accumulate and then all of a sudden you're so happy. Do you see how disgusting my kitchen is? Oh my God, I just saw it in the viewfinder. Okay, last night I had a friend over for dinner. I had a friend over for dinner and uh, I gotta clean, I gotta clean. So that's what I'm doing today. So y'all, I will not vlog uh, Saturday and Sunday. Mm -mm. I'm going to film my official home tour. I'm gonna film my official home tour. It, okay, to film an official home tour, it takes a lot of effort, a lot of effort. This house needs to be spotless. Everything needs to be in its place. Things need to be pristine because the camera catches everything, everything, everything. And I went into the garage. <laughs> okay. You know that little hallway? Let me let me take you up the tripod. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so we're in the, like I'm in the living room sort of. So you see that little hallway there? see the color on the wall it's an itty bitty hallway so it's not it's not going to take me long to do i think you see the tree um and look my 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 snow came off my shelves so i'm gonna have to retape those i'm gonna i got the paint i got my leftover paint and i'm gonna paint that hallway today so i'm gonna put you down my arms hurting yeah i'm gonna paint that little hallway today because when I was taking pictures for Instagram, looks terrible, looks terrible, terrible, terrible. That is my priority today. So I'm gonna do that. Then, oh, the chandelier, that's right. I almost forgot, I'm sorry. Okay, real life, let me flip you around. Look at that, isn't it nice? Y'all, I love it for the price. Oh my goodness, it was a fantastic, fantastic buy. Just a very, very, very plain, modern farmhouse chandelier. Beautiful. Find it on Amazon. I'll link it down below if you're interested. Okay, my peeps. So speaking of Amazon, my shirt, because I know I'm going to get, you know us girls, we love this show. <laughs> so this is a shirt that I got off of Amazon. I ordered it. I love it. I have a whole section in my Amazon store, if you're willing to go by there and see, it really helps me out, y'all, really helps me out. When you purchase anything through Amazon and use my, like go through my link and stuff, you know, it helps a girl out because we gotta get that child to college. Yeah, <laughs> so that's that does help me out. So this is uh, from Amazon. I just, um, it says, in a world full of princesses, be a Beth Dutton. I love her. I mean, her mouth, wow. But she's, you know, she, she's brave. She's brave. When I grow up, I want to be brave like her. I want to be brave like her. You know, I want to, I, I wish I could be that brave. I cannot, I cannot. And um, so that's it for me today. I'm not going to keep you long because I want to go change into my painting clothes. Paint that first. I'm going to blare some Christmas music. I'm in the spirit. I know the reason for the season. And I really want to thank Nancy for giving me that extra edge, like that extra push and a little reminder that he is on the throne always. And no matter what you're going through, no matter how you feel, keep declaring, keep declaring, keep your faith strong. You know, it. Christmas is all about magic and believing in the magic of Christmas and miraculous, 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 miraculous things happen every single day for people. People are cured of cancer. People, um, you know, find love, find love. Yes, they do. Um, they buy homes. They, you know, just he works in mysterious ways. <laughs> Don't ask me how. He works in mysterious ways. But yeah, anyways, that's all that's all I had to say today. I you know, I'm in a grateful and 
I'm in, I'm in, uh, in a gratitude mood and I hope you are too. And I hope you're enjoying your Christmas season. It is a beautiful month in December. I'm looking outside, green grass, palm trees everywhere. It's craziness, it's craziness, but I love it. And I do know the reason for the season. So I am motivated and inspired now to finish all this and pour all my heart and soul into it for our Lord and Savior. So there you go. So you will be seeing my home tour very, very shortly. If not on, um, probably Monday, probably Monday. I think I'm gonna, I, it's got a lot of editing and a lot of cleaning to do, which I told you all that already. So Monday, that'll be up. So Monday's gonna be a great day. And I hope you have a beautiful and blessed weekend. I love you, no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing, stay positive, stay happy, do what you love. Don't let anyone tell you what to do. You know, do what you love. And uh, I'll see you on Monday. Mwah. Bye, YouTube. Bye, everybody. Love you guys.